Hey everyone, this is Carnegie here, and I'm back once again with what will hopefully be the final session of Let's Play The Simpsons Hit and Run. And today I'm going to be covering level 7, which is, well, Trias of Horror based. And this is going to be, well, one of my favourite levels because Trias of Horror specials are one of my f favourite episodes of all time, so. Of a prisoner named Skateboarding Glory. And there's another one of the level gags already. So pretty much the level gags are going to be the same as they always have been in the past. As you can see, everything's all dark, it's all Halloween related. Everything around here. And yeah, I did that handy tip again to get more coins. Just to make sure I get all the items successfully. Okay, no coins? Okay, let's just go up into Bart's room because I know there are some gags in there. If I can get up there, there we are. I can't believe that this is the final time I'm going to be recording this. Like, the, the main story, anyway. I mean, it's just the memories of just been, or the, this Let's Play has just been really incredible. And there's a crusty lamp, and the bed as well, like Bart's old bed from... I, I'm not going to lie, that actually does look like a scary clown bed, that one, but let's get away from that and head outside. And I think there is another... No barbecue grill? Oh, okay, well there's the, the ticky god. I, I think that's what that is anyway. And there's a wasp camera, my first wasp camera. Let's see if I can get this. I know, so the wasp cameras can be very evasive in this. So I've got to keep that, some, keep that in mind when I try to destroy them. Okay, and there's another level gag right there. Well, you better not come out now, Rod and Todd, because there's a zombie apocalypse. Oh, and there's the first collector card, the soul donut from Chairs of Horror 4's, uh, uh, I think it was the Devil and Homer Simpson, and that's what the segment was called. Oh, great, yep, here we go. Get back here. Oh, great, no. Okay, for some reason I managed to body slam it and ended up being destroyed. I, I'd never seen that before, but yeah, I, that, that got to be painful. Screw you, Wasp. You made me lose most of my coins. But I managed to get retribution on you, get coins off you. But anyway, yeah, that's old one that's from Chairs of Horror 4. That's one of my favourite Chairs of Horror specials, but it's not the my absolute favourite. So I'll just keep going here. And I know that there is another wasp camera right here. Oh great, oh! It ran right into my kick. You may be evasive wasp, but that doesn't mean that you're smart at being evasive. Alright, so... Just get all these coins. But yeah, that's the last time I'm recording this. I mean, The Simpsons didn't run the main story. Sad times. But at least the game hadn't corrupted on me. Honestly, I can't even tell why it corrupted beforehand. Oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, no. Oh, that was close. Nearly stung me again. But I got it this time around. Okay, I'm not sure what all those voices are. That's another set of swings. Is that an actual level gang? Oh, it is. That's weird. I'm not sure why that set of swings in the Simpsons backyard. The Simpsons backyard was collapsible, but yeah, it didn't really count as a level gang. Ah, the Krusty doll from Chess of Horror 3. It was a clown without pity. I think that's what it is. Oh, this one. This is phenomenal, this. The house here, it's got this message. If I can get the camera. No TV and no beer make Homer go crazy. No TV make Homer go crazy. Well, that's actually not complete, that quote. It's, it's meant to say, no TV and no beer make Homer go crazy. I remember the quote for that for that episode. I think it was something like, uh, So what do you think, Marge? All I need is a title. I was thinking along the lines of, No TV and no beer make Homer something something. And Marge said, Go crazy? And Homer says, don't mind if I do, and then he just starts going crazy. <laughs> the Shining, or, sorry, no, not The Shining. The Shining was one of my, or in fact, it's my favourite, like, Trace of Horror special of all time. Oh. Okay. There we are. Yeah, I'm expecting these wasps to be very hard to destroy, and so far they've been 
proving quite a challenge, but I'm getting the hang of it. Of course I am. I know how to destroy them, but it's just like, like, handling their evasive maneuvers. But yeah, the, the Shining was one of my favourite ones. I mean, especially the quote when uh, Bart... Yeah, just to be warned here, I am going to be making a lot of Trials of Horror references in this episode. But, especially the one with the quote where, like, um, I think it was the scene where Bart was, uh, like... Oh, excuse me for a minute, guys. Just... Sorry about that, guys. I think I bet had a bit of an itchy nose there. Should be all good now. And, well, I ended up falling. Okay, so, but yeah, I remember that scene that was where uh, groundskeeper Willie and Bart were, um, oh great, I keep falling into the water. Now, I know that there's a collector's card here, as you might see it is over there. Now, I'm going to need to do a spot platforming to get this uh, collector's card. Alright, there we are. Oh, that was close. No, he fell off there. I just have to go on these rotating uh, coffins. Okay, so far so good. There we are. The Hell Toupee from... I'll just dive in the water. The Hell Toupee from Chess of Horror 9. That was the one where a Snake uh, ended up getting electrocuted. Like, he got, he got killed by the electric chair and then uh, for like uh, the third penalty crime thing, I think that's what it was, and then uh, Homer ended up getting the, well, getting Snake's hair, and it ended up uh, possessing him. That was also a good tale as well, but my favourite is still the singing. Just going back to that scene, like, where, uh, like, when Bart was going through the, the hedge maze, like, with a chainsaw, and, and Bart started reading uh, uh, Groundskeeper all his thoughts, and... And then uh, Willie says, you've got the shining. And then Bart says, you mean shining. And Willie says, you want to get sued? <laughs> that was funny, that quote there. Was, especially the one, you want to get sued for using like the, that title there, The Shining. Because that's the name of the actual uh, movie. Okay, I'm just going to go about and explore and get all the wasp cameras. And the collector cards if I can. And just scale this bridge for the final time. As you can see, the water down below is Buzz Cola, and I wouldn't want to have a, a water system filled with cola. It's just it wouldn't be very appropriate. And there's the camera up there. Is that is that Marge up there, or is that an actual witch? Because that looked like Marge as a witch flying up in the sky there. Okay, so we just. Trying to be careful up on this bridge. Alright, Wasp. You're going down. He's like, hmm? What are you going to do about it? Well, here's what I'm going to do. This. And luckily that Wasp wasn't flying around. Honestly, if I were flying around... Uh, oh, great. I just ended up missing those coins. Oh, well. Doesn't matter. I'll just go. I was hoping to get all those coins, but there was nothing else up there anyway, so I'm just going to... carry on exploring. As you can see, there's no pedestrians, there's all zombies. And I do like the music for this level, it's, uh, well, Halloween based. Well, obviously it is. Alright then, so, there's two more wasp cameras on top of these, uh, caravans. Okay, there we are, that's one down. Hopefully I don't slide off here. Okay, good. There we are, that's all the coins collected from that. But, that was a funny scene, that one. From Chairs of Horror 5. Chairs of Horror 5 is probably my favourite Halloween special of all time. If you've seen the Halloween specials of The Simpsons, uh, then feel free to comment down below on which one, which is your favourite Halloween special because I've been. And I just lost out on those coins. That's great. Not really, but, oh well. Oh wait, maybe not. I might still have a chance. No, okay, they're going now. Oh well. 
Yeah, I keep getting this itchy feeling in my nose. I uh, see there's a zombie right there. And there's another one there. I'm surprised they're not all going after me. Okay. And I do like Homer's car in this. I mean, it's uh, the perfect like car for speed. But it's just the... The handling of it can be quite tricky sometimes. Now, the trickiest wasp camera to get is in here, and there's a collector's card in here as well. Not a very good driver. I'll keep that between... I'll keep that in mind, Homer, as a kind of secret, but anyway. Not really, since you just told it to me anyway, you just gave it away. Now, the collector's card is there. And just jump for it. I got it. And it's a monkey's paw from Chairs of Horror 2. Oh great, I just made that wasp mad. And I remember that segment. Oh, wait, where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's right there. Okay, it's still behind that uh, thing. Ah, oh, missed. See, the hardest thing about this is like getting onto that again. I mean, I, I think I got lucky the first time I did that. Okay, let's see if I can get the timing right here. Okay, wait for that to go back. Go. Right. Oh. Yep, it's mad. See, look, it's like, mm, I'm wanting to get you so bad. Okay, let's see if I can hit. Oh, I got it on the ground. Okay, I can't see the... There we are. Okay, good. I'm surprised it didn't sting me there, because it was a bad camera there. Okay, good. That's our wasp camera destroyed. And I'm not going to collect all the wasp cameras. I'm going to collect most or nearly all of them, because there's one wasp camera that I'm going to get that I'm going to save for much later uh, in the session. But there is one at the power plant that I'm going to get. And there's a level gag right here, the same one that was seen in the previous two levels, levels 1 and 4. So there's that one. I'll just run across the parking lot because I know that there's a camera right here. Yep, there you are. Ah, come on. No. No. Ah! Oh, come on. There we are. Yeah, these wasp cameras are pretty difficult to destroy, but at least I got it. Okay, now I need to turn back because you can see the power plant is closed off. So I can't access Mr. Brunson's mansion or any other buildings like that on the other side. But and you'll be able to see why. Which I'm going to drive all the way over to the school and you'll see why I'm... Um, not able to destroy all the or sorry I'm getting all my words mixed up today uh, access Mr. Burns' mansion okay let's see oh okay that was quite close actually I thought I was going to end up going into the tire fire there but yeah this level is the trickiest, I mean, out of all the levels, I mean, as is expected, because it's the final level of the game, of course it's going to be the hardest. It'd be kind of a letdown if it was the easiest level out of all the levels, but this level is very difficult, so I might cut some bits here and there for certain missions. Okay, now I'm going to go into the Quickie Mart, because there are some level gags there and I'll need to collect. As you can see, the vehicles have changed as well, and the there's a like a bonus mission made there with Smithers, but the vehicles have changed in this level as well. Okay, yep, there's the level gag for that arcade machine, and I'll just skip this one because we've seen that before. Okay, so there was that. Silent alarm. And then the squishing machine. Okay. 
Okay, well, I didn't really mean to talk to Apu there, but... Okay, so how many gags are there in this level? I've nearly got all of them, actually. Just need to get three more. I'm trying to think of where they could be, actually. I know that I've got to go up here, so... Let me just go in here. Yep, there we are. And I know that there is another wasp here. And this one is going to start dodging again. Ah, oh, there we are. I was actually a lot more quicker this time in destroying it. Okay. Oh, and I managed to land on that platform from double jumping all the way over there. I mean, that was quite surprising, actually. I didn't expect that. Okay, now, I know that there is another camera here. Where is it? Aha! Alright. Okay, there's that destroyed. Oh, and I'm surprised that one hasn't... isn't planning on getting vengeance on me for destroying its comrade. It's just watching me collect all the coins. I don't think there's really anything much else to say, guys. I mean, I might as well talk about things that have happened to me this week. I mean, college has been going well, uh, just going through my subjects one by one. The performances, like, my pieces are going well in preparation for performances. Oh, and there's the fifth collector's card, the Time Travel Toaster, from Chairs of Horror 5. Oh, yeah, Time and Punishment, that was a great tale as well. I remember that uh, Chairs of Horror segment, that was hilarious. I wouldn't say it's my favourite in Chase of Horror 5, it's still hilarious, I mean it's the best one. The, the most gruesome one though in Chase of Horror 5 is, well, uh, Nightmare Cafeteria. But, but for those who have seen Chase of Horror 5, you'll know what I'm talking about when it comes to time and punishment. Nothing if only it were Halloween by the time I, I was playing this level, but sadly it's not to be, I mean it's, uh, it's spring, so... Halloween is all seven months away, so... Okay, and I better be careful here because I'm about to get a hit and run. Okay, now I need to go into the school because I know that there are level gags in the school that I can go and collect. Oh, and you might hear my chair squeak there for a little bit. Okay. That's it. Oh, Mr. Burns. What are they collecting there? Is that... What is that? They're collect is that nuclear waste? I don't know what that is they just collected there, but... Okay. Alright, so I've got one more level gag to find. I'm trying to think if there's any... Anywhere I missed. There could be... Okay, I need to go into the school's backyard. And I heard a wasp camera spawning on top of the uh, the school's roof. And there's one right here. Okay, let's get rid of that. But yeah, things have been going well this week at college. Uh, and my subject is going well and just thinking about options for next year as well but at the moment I'm wanting to focus on getting this degree complete on the human cookbook that's from Chase of Horror 1 from the very first Chase of Horror that was uh, the segment where uh, Kang and Koro's uh, uh, abducted the Simpsons for the first time and oh, there's a wasp camera right here right and the tractor beam which is a uh, see I thought that this wasp camera would be very difficult to destroy because it's at a different camera view but it's not not that much new to me. I mean, it's just another wasp camera to destroy. That's all it is. Oh. Okay, right. I'll take care of you. Oh, okay. There we are. That was close. I got it just before it uh, started taking, uh, before it started uh, evading my moves. Or my attacks. Okay, camera. Oh, the camera's off. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna have to try that again. I don't know if the commentary... Is that commentary a bit too loud? Maybe not. But yeah, I'll need to try that again. The camera was a bit off. 
Oh, come on. 